Hello everyone, welcome to the Mathematics in my channel. Another interesting integral minus infinity to infinity. Uh, you know, a binomial coefficient uh, here n choose r dr. Okay, uh, n choose r. Uh, I think I said, remember when we learn in grade 12 uh, mathematics, pure mathematics, uh, n choose r uh, in textbooks, uh, it's appeared. Uh, like uh, n uh, c r n choose r anyway so we know this one also equal to n factorial over r factorial n minus r factorial okay uh, here n factorial here n here r factorial so here r here uh, n minus r so n minus r factorial okay uh, then n plus 1 uh, choose r plus 1 uh, minus n choose r is equal to uh, so we are going to simplify this one uh, we have n plus 1 uh, factorial over r plus 1 uh, factorial times uh, n minus r factorial minus and here we have n factorial a factorial n minus a factorial well uh, then if you take a common denominator uh, a plus 1 factorial times n minus a or factorial so here we have n plus 1 uh, factorial uh, here both are replaced in the denominator so we have n plus 1 factorial times 1 uh, then minus here n factorial times uh, we know r plus 1 okay uh, then this n plus 1 factorial uh, we can write n factorial times uh, n plus 1 so n factorial we can take outside uh, as a factor so here uh, we have n plus 1 minus r minus 1 over here r plus 1 factorial n minus r factorial well minus 1 plus 1 uh, get cancelled and uh, also we can write here uh, n factorial n minus r over here r plus 1 factorial and this one we can write uh, n minus r times n minus r minus 1 factorial well then n minus r uh, get cancelled uh, so we have n factorial over r plus 1 factorial times n minus r minus 1 factorial okay this one uh, we can write n choose r plus 1 n choose r plus so we know uh, here we have n plus 1 choose uh, r plus 1 uh, then minus n choose r minus n choose r is equal to n uh, choose r plus 1 so we can write uh, now n plus 1 choose uh, r plus 1 is equal to uh, n choose r uh, plus n choose r plus 1 also uh, if you notice uh, when n approaches to infinity when n approaches to infinity uh, n plus 1 choose r plus 1 uh, we know approximately equal to n choose r and uh, n choose r plus 1 so we can write uh, now um, yeah uh, if we integrate minus infinity to infinity n plus 1 choose r plus 1 uh, dr is equal to now we can write this is equal to 2 times minus infinity to infinity n choose r dr okay uh, then um, here if you take this integral is equal to uh, j n 
this one we know uh, j n plus one so we have j n plus one is equal to two times uh, j n so if you take j n we know two times j n minus one so if you take j n minus one we know two times j n minus two and j n is equal to uh, we know uh, this is going to uh, two times two times two times two and this is going to two times j naught so uh, we have uh, j n is equal to uh, two 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 so two to the n times j naught okay uh, then j n we know uh, j n j n is equal to minus infinity to infinity and choose r d r then uh, j naught is equal to minus infinity to infinity uh, 0 choose r d r so now we can evaluate uh, j naught so we have uh, minus infinity to infinity uh, we know this one 0 factorial over r factorial uh, here minus r, r factorial d r well uh, then we can write here minus infinity to infinity uh, 0 factorial we know 1 r factorial we can write gamma of uh, 1 uh, plus r here minus r factorial uh, so we can write gamma of 1 minus r uh, then here dr then uh, minus infinity to infinity dr over gamma of r plus 1 we know r times uh, gamma of r and here gamma of uh, 1 minus r then this one uh, we know gamma of x gamma of 1 minus x Euler's reflection formula so we know minus infinity to infinity here dr over uh, this one Euler's reflection formula we know gamma of x gamma of 1 minus x is equal to pi over sine of uh, pi x so here we have dr over uh, r uh, times pi uh, here sine of pi r okay uh, then as a next step here minus infinity to infinity and uh, we know pi is a constant so 1 over uh, pi and uh, sine of pi r over uh, r dr uh, and uh, here minus infinity to infinity so we can write 2 over pi now limit 0 to infinity sine of pi r over uh, r dr so we solve this type of uh, integral this integral also in uh, pre uh, previous videos i think two three videos so we have 2 over pi times pi over 2 pi over 2 so pi get cancelled 2 uh, get cancelled this is equal to 1 so j naught is equal to 1 uh, then we know uh, j n is equal to uh, 2 to the n 2 to the n times uh, j naught now j naught is equal to uh, 1 so we know j n is equal to 2 to the n okay this is the answer if you like this type of videos please subscribe this channel thank you for watching